So here's how I made the Zack King Egg Bounce effect in DaVinci Resolve. Three things you're going to need. One is you bouncing a ping pong. Two is of you dropping the egg in the pan. And three is a clean plate. And this one, the clean plate wasn't long enough. So what you have to do is take this clean plate, right click on your mouse, go up to change clip speed and click freeze frame. And now you've got a clean plate. Once you have these three different scenes, you're gonna match these all up with the balance of the egg. You can use a waveform here at the bottom or take the second video and change your opacity down. So here's what we have. Bring your opacity back up. And lastly, the clean plate. So we'll take these three, bring them over to the color tab. In the color tab, we're gonna do a little, little bit of masking. We're gonna take the second video that you have with the egg dropping. We're gonna mask around the egg. So scroll in here. In the middle, we're gonna make sure you click on the window section and come down to the pen tool. On the right side, under this node section here, if you don't have a node, you can click on the node menu. We're gonna right click, add alpha output. This creates a little circle on the right. We're gonna connect the two blue circle and blue squares together. And what this does is this now creates that hole in this video. So if we go back over to the edit page, we can now see our egg, which is step one. But step two, we still have this ping pong ball, which we gotta get rid of. With the clean plate, we're gonna use this to the right side to get rid of any shadows or the ping pong ball. Back into the color page here. Again, add alpha output, connect the two, zoom out, and this will be the right side of the video. Now if we go back to the edit page, see what we have so far. You can also notice there's a little bit of a lighting change between the two here. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna use a feather to soften that up a little bit. The bottom here, the inside and the outside, you can create a little bit more of a feather effect here. Just so it's not so harsh. over again and here is our egg effect one final thing make sure you get rid of the audio of the ping pong bouncing around There we go. Hope you enjoyed. If you like what you saw, make sure to like button below. Subscribe if you want to see more. Hit the bell notification if you want to see notified every time I upload content. And drop a comment in the comment section below. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving this week. Hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.